good morning, South Lake family and friends. Today is day 18 of our 21 Days in the Word journey together. We're in week three, if you're just joining us. We're reading through the book of Acts over these 21 days, and you can access our reading plan and other resources that we have on our website, southlakechurch.com. And there we've provided uh, the, the reading plan, a memory verse for each day's reading, and then this daily devotional which will correlate to the memory verse. Going to be very brief with you today. Today, according to our prayer guide, please read Acts chapter 25. And our memory verse today is Acts 25 verse 18. And I'm reading this in the Passion Translation. It says this, Rather, their issues centered around disagreements with him over their religion and about a dead man named Jesus, who Paul claimed was alive. <laughs> Now that verse strikes me as being so pertinent to our times as well as Paul's times because Paul was the one claiming before everybody, and this is the crux of the whole faith, the Christian faith that we share, that we proclaim, is that we really believe Jesus is alive. That the scripture tells us that, but we've experienced that, not only us, but throughout history, people, by the millions and even billions. And so it's, it's really so foundational to our faith. It was to Paul, it is for us. Because we live in a world, as did he, people just won't, you know, at first they don't believe it. You know, it's like, what do you mean? A resurrection, what do you mean? This dead man has come back to life. Well, well, it's either true or it's not. And we know it to be true by faith in his grace but because the Holy Spirit has been given, heaven has been promised, we've walked with Jesus. Someone wise once said, he that has an experience is never at the mercy of he that has only an argument. And so let's focus this day just very simply on Jesus is alive and he's alive in you and he's alive in me. So let's walk with him. Let's live in him. Let's witness for him. And let's be very confident, humble, but confident, listen, we're walking with a Savior that is alive. He is living. And what could be more thrilling and inspiring than that this day or any day? Let me pray for us. Lord, thank you for just that simple fact, the, the resurrection. That, Lord, though you were dead, yet now you live. And Lord, your word says that, that we are crucified with you. Nevertheless, we live, yet not I, but Christ that lives in me. The life that I now live, I live by faith in the Son of God. Lord, we believe you're alive. So live in us today. We commit this day to you. Let your life fill us and permeate us. And may we be witnesses for you this day. Pray, Lord, you provide, protect, and direct our families, our uh, church family, protect and provide for each one of us. And we give you all the praise in Jesus' name. Say amen with me. Amen. Well, God bless you. Look forward to talking to you in the morning. Have a great day.